Okay. I'm going to do a short video on how to set up and navigate through the Amazon Fire Stick. <clears throat> With the Amazon Fire Stick, all you have to do is make your purchase of the Fire Stick. You plug it into your HDMI port on your TV. I actually have an extension running from my port down. I'm actually using the power cord that they supply, but I have it plugged into the front of the, uh, the cable box. I do still have cable. I have the lowest package cable that you can you can get with the uh, the fourth tier internet through Uverse. So I have cut my cable bill from 248 a month down to about I think it's like 142 146 a month now so I've saved roughly a hundred dollars a month on my cable bill <clears throat> when you hook up the fire stick this will be the first screen that you see until you get hooked up to the uh, network none of these will pop up which are pre-installed netflix um slang all these are pre-installed on the amazon fire stick you will not actually use any of these because you will use the side load program called cody it is running the beast version <clears throat> what you want to do first is you'll go down to settings you will go over to system you will go down to network if you do not see your network you will have to rescan mine is already connected once it says connected you hit the home button on the remote one time it will take you into here. This is the Beast. The Beast is the newest version of Cody. The Beast allows everything to be free, 100%. Kid movies. You got your men's area, which is not only adult men's area, but you have boxing's greatest fights, sports documents, documentaries, drug movies, uh, the women's area. You have emotional movies, you have workout option videos, uh, you have your favorites. <clears throat> this just takes a little time to navigate through to get familiar with. Phoenix is probably one of the more reliable <clears throat> for movies old and new movies that are still in the theater um, one this one the one two four two one four five the rock crusher and the stale 2014 all three are very reliable if you click on to the one <clears throat> you see that it, it loads up fairly fast if you go down to HD releases um, so you want to watch Black Mass with Johnny Depp see I, I already started it a minute ago we'll go ahead and resume you know give it 15 20 seconds to, to load you got to keep in mind that you're going out on the internet and you're searching for the stream directly that other people has chosen to share. So here's your Black Mass video with Johnny Depp. And fast forward it. Okay. We're going to stop this one. I'm going to back out with the back button on the remote. <clears throat> I'm going to go over to Rock Crusher, 
show you Rock Crusher. You can go, you know, kids, all these different years, current movies, current TV shows, you know, you want to watch a, a, a movie on from 2015. <clears throat> Excuse me. And we'll go down the list a while and see. And we'll check out uh, Avengers, see what Avengers look like. Might have to click onto it again. Start from the beginning. <clears throat> yep. All right. This is a message that you might see quite often. Playback failed. You hit OK. Sometimes it just goes out and tries to search and it, it might not find something. So if you click onto it again, you might have to click onto it once or twice or sometimes even three times before it actually goes out and searches and, and finds the link. That's not a problem. If for whatever reason that it, it is unsuccessful in finding the link, then you may just have to find that particular movie under a different, um, you know, category, different um, streamer. <clears throat> yep, okay. So we're going to, uh, let's try Ant-Man. We'll try. So it looks like that uh, the Avengers link may just be a, a broken link. You know, maybe it's had problems or maybe, <clears throat> you know, maybe there's just a lot of people trying to stream that link. That's possible. But as you can see, everything's, uh, you know, good DVD quality. Right, we're going to stop this one. Yeah, I'm going to back out of it with my arrow buck, uh, back button. And we're going to try the third one under Phoenix, which is called Steel. Dale 2014. <clears throat> when you open this one up, <coughs> excuse me. Same thing, we're going to go into the 2015 HD movies. <clears throat> I have noticed that the Stale puts a lot of screeners on. A screener is basically a DVD version of a movie that is still in the theater. You know, Joy, Concussion, we'll, we'll click on Concussion. Now see on this stale, it pops up different links. So what you'll want to do is you'll obviously start at the top, click on the first link. If it works, you're good to go. If it doesn't work, then you just go down to the next link. You just click on a link or two or three or however many links you have to click on to in order for it to start working. This is link number one. Looks like it's working now. Like I said, sometimes it takes 10, 15, 20 seconds to, to pick up and, and you know go out and start searching. <clears throat> but as you can see this is uh and i i do know that i watched this uh, this movie concussion with will smith uh about four or maybe five days after it came out on release at the theater so <clears throat> once again it's a dvd quality version Okay, we're going to stop this and we're going to back out. <clears throat> I'm going to show you uh, TV. There are some people that uh, choose to cancel their cable altogether. You can. I personally don't recommend it because not all cable channels are reliable. But if you want to go into Phoenix TV, 
you know, there's different things that you can watch. There's entertainment, there's world news, there's live sports, there's, you know, I found this one to be pretty reliable, the USA Canada sports. You know, if you want to watch, uh, say, the Golf Channel, <clears throat> you know, if you want to watch the Golf Channel, you can watch it in HD. Flick onto that. For the year. Right there's your live golf. I think you, you want to try ESPN? Now I have I have realized that ESPN comes in. It does not come in in HD. There are HD links, but you just have to search uh, other providers. As I said, sometimes when you click onto a link, it may take 15, 20 seconds for it to find. Um, if it does not, within the first 25 or 30 seconds, I generally go down to the next one and try it. <clears throat> so here you go. Okay. Now this is standard definition. So it might be slightly fuzzy, it might flicker a little bit here and there, but it's live TV and it's free. Okay. Uh, you got all these different sports channels. You got golf, you got MLB, NBA, NFL Network, NFL Now. Um, The another one is on the actual movies tab. When you go into, let me, let me stop this real quick. The way I am bringing up the function button up here is I'm just hitting the OK button or the Enter button that's in the center of the directional pad. Uh, go over to stop, and that stops whatever movie or, or show you're watching. Um, under the movies tab. You have the stale 2014, the one I showed you earlier under the Phoenix. SALTS is another good one. SALTS basically is an acronym. It stands for Streaming All Live um, Threads, I think is what it stands for. One Channel. One Channel is a good one as well. Um, TV Shows. If you want to watch any type of TV series, you will find that under TV shows. Okay, you can go to what's trending, what's popular. You know, if you want to watch whatever, The Walking Dead, Breaking Bad, Empire. Um, I mean, you see all these. x Wild, Supergirl, Scorpion, Blacklist, Lucifer, Arrow. It tells you what network it's from, NCIS, The Big Bang Theory. Uh, when you click on to it, it will bring up every season that has ever been out. You can go back and watch every single season if you want to. <clears throat> you know, friends, or, or if you're a person that enjoys friends, you can go back and watch all 10 episodes or 10 seasons of uh, Friends. You know, you want to go back to the very first season and watch it. Click on to it. It comes up, it tells you. <clears throat> this is the very first Friends that ever came out. It's streaming, it's, it's gathering all the information. <clears throat> Uh oh okay this is a good message because now you can see it says stream all the sources that's what salt stands for stream all the sources <clears throat> okay now it's saying that that's not coming up so what I will do is I will go out of there and I will go to uh, Genesis TV shows same 
same thing. You can go to what people's watching. You can go to the particular network. You can go to the year, most popular. Uh, we'll go to what people's watching. Okay, pretty much the same, same thing. So now we'll go to friends under the Genesis. And we'll go to season one. And we'll go click on this one. It's gathering all the information. Alright, now you have individual links. As you can see, I have HD link. HQ stands for high quality. As you go down the list, it gets all the way down to low quality. Now obviously you want to watch it in the best quality that you can watch. So we're going to go all the way back up to the top. It's a good one the other way. And we're going to click on the first link. Movie TV slash movie TV slash HD. Uh oh. Back up. Alright. Now it says no stream available. So now we're going to go down to the next one. We're going to click on it. No stream available. So we're going to go down to the next one. We'll click on that. <clears throat> All right, looks like it's gathering some information. It generally doesn't take this long. Usually it's 15, 20 seconds. All right. Now you can see it's buffering down at the bottom. <laughs> And there you have friends. Alright, All right, we're going to stop this one. So you get a general idea of how the TV shows go. I mean, you can go even under the TV shows. You know, we'll, we'll go back to Genesis again because I know Genesis is pretty, pretty reliable. If there's a TV show that you want to search for <clears throat> you can go down to you can search by the person you can search by the show you know say you're uh say you want to go back and watch um i don't know we'll say the dukes of hazard we're going to type in well, it's probably the dukes of hazard right or is it just dukes of hazard that's a good question dukes This is a pretty smart program, so if I type in just the Dukes, it should recognize the Dukes. Here we go, the Dukes of Hazard. Okay, we're going to go back and watch some old school Dukes and Hazards, all the way back to season one. One Arm Bandit came out in 1979, January 26th. Hey, that's today. 1979. <clears throat> I think next time I make one of these videos I'm going to get a get a stand for my phone my arm's starting to burn <laughs> alright just like before we're going to start with the first one and we'll see if that one opens up if it doesn't then you go down to the next one you just go down the list until you find one that opens like this one might open you know a lot of people complain about the process that you have to go through but I don't mind going through a couple you know a couple clicks and a couple you know minute or two of waiting for something to load up if it's free I mean I don't really know too many people that complain about anything that's free
<clears throat> there we go. You got Dukes of Hazard, January 26, 1979, the very first episode. They didn't even have the. They didn't even have the uh, good old boys theme going yet. All right. I think you got a general idea of how the TV shows work. So we're going to back out of here. Back, 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 all the way back. I'm going to show you the pay-per-view. This is probably going to be your biggest money saver by watching pay-per-view fights. <clears throat> You go to the 3 p.m. section, press down, and you go over to Sports Devil. When you open up Sports Devil, you're going to go to Live Sports. Now, there's many different channels in the Live Sports. The ones that I have found that is the most reliable is the VIP Box, the Roja Directa, LS Hunter, the first row sports either one of them and then the ATD HE net now they all do the same function they will allow you to watch the sports but they may be set up slightly different when you get into them so we're gonna click on the ATD net now you can watch ESPN NFL Network and then it has individual games now these are games all around the world you can watch college basketball NFL NBA baseball when it's in season um, soccer and it obviously that's a soccer ball so that means it's a soccer game uh, that looks like it's a basketball game because it's got a basketball but it pretty much breaks everything down and it's all around the world no matter where you're at um, we're going to back out of this one and I'll take you to First Row Sports. First Row Sports is set up. You can watch American football, boxing, WWE, UFC, soccer, as in football, basketball, hockey, baseball, tennis, motorsports, rugby, darts, snooker, golf, handball, cricket. I mean, pretty much anything you want to watch. You know. Say, for instance, and it probably will not be loaded, but I'll show you. Uh, this coming Saturday, there is a there is no stream available. So, uh, let's go down to VIP box because they usually put their stuff on, you know, the, the literature. They put it on pretty early. We're going to go to the UFC because there's UFC 196 is coming up this Saturday. So, they will have it on here. Uh, da, 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 da. right here UFC 196 now obviously it's not set up or streaming at the moment but you can get on here as early as 9 o'clock p.m. Um, and watch the uh, preliminaries and everything uh, Monday Night Raw um, UFC on Fox Bellator 148 the ultimate fighter I mean it's got everything everything anything you can you can go back and watch you know, older fights. <clears throat> you know, same thing. You can go and watch American football. Not sure what's going to be listed right now, but you got ESPN, ESPN2, NFL Network, Red Zone, Thursday Night Football, you know, the Pro Bowl Draft. I mean, it's got all this stuff. Uh, let's see. Let's try the Roja Directa. Snooker championships. You know, you want to learn how to play snooker. You never played snooker before. You just pick whatever link you want to. I always start at, start at the top link, work my way down. <clears throat> All right. Looks like it didn't do anything. So we're going to open up the next one. Try the next one. 
Like I said, sometimes you can find a stream, sometimes you can't. But there's literally hundreds and thousands of streams that you can just search through. You just have to find what channel has what. All right, none of these channels are working, so we're gonna get out of here. Now in the LS Hunter, I have found that the um, UFC is usually under the others and it will actually be dated. So I'm not sure if anything can be on here or not. Looks like they got the snooker on this one as well. All right, let's try one of these links here. like snooker does not want to come up today but anyways you get the general idea of where your um, your live sports are uh, especially for the pay-per-view now you can go in you can watch you know pay-per-view under this one I've never tried it before it actually has a pay-per-view tab on it and it's under the sports TV we'll click onto it to see what it has to offer now there's not even you know, UFC going on right now, so. so I'm not sure what's what. This has a bunch of live streams. But I'm not sure what they're live to. Let's let's check and see what it, see what's live. You have to meet the physical with physical and then you'll get a skill for And that's a big challenge for Liverpool today. All right, looks like it's soccer. All right, this was something totally different. Like I said, every one of these will be different. All right, we're going to stop that. Um, last but not least, this is what I recommend to do a, at least once a week. I myself, every time I'm getting ready to start using the fire stick to watch a movie or, or, you know, a fight or whatever, I'll go under and do this and it kind of frees up. The fire stick has its own processor in it. So just like a, uh, um, you know, a computer, a laptop, a phone, it, it collects cookies. It collects temporary internet files. So what I recommend is going in and deleting the packages and deleting the cache. Very simple, it's under the Chris B tab. You delete packages. Okay, it says no packages to delete, which is fine. Delete the cache. See, it has 36 files. That's all the files that I just went in and was showing you. Every time you click onto a link, that's a new file that, that it saves. So I delete those. Now it keeps that processing speed, you know, fast. You know, the you know, kids area, like like I said, it's got everything. Everything and anything you can think of. It's got the latest movies, it's got Disney movies, it's got Disney princess movies. We'll see what the latest movies are. Alright, now these looks like all just basic kid movies. Inside Out, Tomorrowland, Monkey Kingdom, Descendants, Teen Beach 2. And let's go to the next page. Cinderella, Bad Hair Day, Sophia the First, Tinkerbell, Big Hero 6. Into the woods. Uh, Alexander the Terrible, How to Build a Better Boy. Earth to Echo, Plains Fire and Rescue.
I mean, so you can see it's got a wide variety of, uh, you know, kid movies. Uh, we'll, we'll click on Lilo and Stitch. Let's see, see what comes up. All right, saying that it has an error. Okay. Back, back, back. Kids and animation. All right, so the new one just came out, The Good Dinosaur. We'll click on that and see what it has. It has four different links. We'll try the first one. There you go. Save you some money from going to the theater. You can take your kids, you know, save yourself 30, 40, 50 bucks, 60 bucks, however many kids you got. <clears throat> Frozen fever. No, that was a that was a pretty big hit in the theater. frozen fever all right now we're going to go back over to Chris B we're going to check the packages no packages the cash so we got 10 files again so like I said every time you click on that link it opens up a file and that's pretty much the gist of the Amazon fire stick you, know, you get the men's area you get the women's area your favorites Phoenix uh, just for quick reference if you want to start watching a TV show series we're going to go down to Genesis TV shows <clears throat> we're going to go to uh, we'll go to highly rated okay Breaking Bad you know a lot of people like the Breaking Bad before you actually click into the Breaking Bad if you want you can hit the the menu button right here and you can add it to your favorites Breaking Bad added to favorites so now when you go into Genesis TV shows and you're at the top of the list here you go to your favorites right there's your Breaking Bad <clears throat> 